Hello, my name is Professor Joseph Yang, and I'm a course director for the BEng and MEng Electrical and Electronic Engineering degrees, which are offered through the Department of Electrical Engineering and Electronics at the University of Liverpool. We have offered these degree programs for over 20 years, and our graduates are well sought after by industry. We continuously enhance our delivery at the course content through engagement with our industrial advisory board and the Institute of Engineering and Technology who accredit all of our degree programs. So what is electric and electronic engineering all about? Electric and electronic engineering covers different aspects of a subject area, such as electrical systems and power generation electronics, including solid-state devices and digital circuits and communication systems. Our programs are designed to accommodate the interests of our students by introducing four different pathways, the details of which can be found from a departmental web page. For example, the electrical engineering pathway addresses a pressing needs for green electrical power generation and delivery. You will gain solid knowledge and understanding of renewable power generation based on wind and solar energy, for example, and how we connect them to the white electricity grids by using advanced power electronics converters. For those of you who are interested in electronics, you will be equipped with knowledge and the skills of semiconductor technology, such as the fundamentals on how modern solid-state devices work, how to make these devices, and how they can be used to design electronic and digital systems, including microprocessors. For communications, you will understand how information is communicated at a physics level, for example, using wireless technology based on antennas, and at algorithm level, such as using digital information coding theory to design an efficient system. You will also have the opportunity to develop knowledge and understanding on the most advanced topics such as 5G communications. The delivery and contents of our programs are also informed by our excellent research and supported by the unique facilities in the department. To have a few examples on the list, Sunset City as the first example, which is just located near the university, was set up using UK Government Fund and the European Regional Development Fund. It acts as a bridge between the university research and industry across the whole globe for technology transfer, and it can be the ideal vehicle to use if you develop innovative ideas during your study. Wind turbines and solar panels, as you can see now, are installed on the roof of our departmental building for research and of course for final year projects. And you can be one of the students to operate and control them during your final year projects. We also have a high power lab in the department which is unique among all UK universities. It is open to final year projects if one of you are interested in low carbon, environmentally friendly high voltage technology. For those who want to develop a career in electronics, we have a large and high standard clean room to fabricate solid state components. The department has also a range of test equipment to support your learning and final year projects. If you prefer a degree in communications, the department has a suite of facilities, including a multi-purpose wireless test chamber and a 5G test bed that was set up with funding from the UK government. In your first year, you will take modules in a range of subject areas, including mathematics, electromagnetism, electrical circuit systems, electronic circuits, 
and digital and integrated electronics design. These modules in year one will provide you with a strong foundational basis to undertake more advanced topics in year two and year, in year three. For example, in year two, you will take electric circuits and power systems, which also includes renewable power generation, CMOS integrated circuits, and digital electronics and microprocessor systems. And in year three, Depending on the pathway, you may take power generation and distribution, digital system design, or digital and wireless communications. When you start your year one study, you will register on one of the four program pathways. In case you develop a stronger interest in another pathway, you will have the opportunity to switch between different pathways before you start your year 3. In all years of study, there is a strong emphasis on lab work to enable you to put into practice the concepts that you learn in your lectures. We have two dedicated modules for you to develop experimental and engineering skills. A year to many projects for you to gain experience in teamwork and project management. And of course, we have a large number of theoretical or hardware-based final year projects to suit your interest. For example, you can use your knowledge in digital systems and communication to design and test a wireless system to monitor the state of a medical equipment. You can also try a smart algorithm to maximize the electrical power that can be generated from a wind turbine. You can join the program for a three-year bachelor or a four-year integrated master degree. Both the bachelor's and the master's can be combined with a year in industry or up to a year studying abroad. The four-year master's will benefit you on the road to becoming a trusted engineer as you will be able to take our most advanced courses relating to the current state of art in the subject area, such as distributed renewable power generation, smart grid, microprocess design, or wireless systems. With a degree in electrical and electronic engineering from the University of Liverpool, you will have demonstrated that you have the advanced subject knowledge and the core competencies to flourish in sectors such as energy systems, electrical vehicles and airplanes, microprocess design, artificial intelligence, and mobile communications. Thank you.